Well, we just completed 2018 for what if Neymar never left Barcelona, and now we are up to 2019. To begin the year, Barcelona are still top of the, of the La Liga. And won the Super Copa against Sevilla. We got the round of 16 in the Copa del Rey coming up against Levante. Real, Real Madrid beat AC Milan in the Super Cup. Anyways, let's go to the round of 16 matchups of the Champions League. You got, well, you got Borussia Dortmund versus Barcelona. Inter Milan versus Chelsea. PSB versus Manchester City. Paris Saint Germain versus Tottenham Hotspur. Porto versus Manchester United. Bayern Munich versus Atletico Madrid. Hoffenheim versus Ajax. And Valencia versus CSKA Moscow. Now for the round of 32 in the Europa League. you got Bordeaux versus AC Milan. Tondela versus POOK. Shakhtar versus Sporting Club de Portugal. Spartak Moscow versus Sevilla. Dynamo Kiev versus Benfica. Arsenal versus Villarreal. Monaco versus Benabarchi. Red Bull Salzburg versus Real Madrid. Fiorentina versus Red, Red Bull Leipzig. Geck versus Leverkusen. Burnley versus Reimer. And Lokomotiv Moscow versus Marseille. Juventus versus Lava Pro versus Lavia Prague. Liverpool versus Besiktas. Real Betis versus Stad, Re Stad Ren. And Dinamo Zagreb versus Leon. Anyways, let's get to, let's get January off to the, off to a bang. Hopefully, Barcelona, I don't believe Real Betis are actually second in the league right now. Well, let's renegotiate Sergio Roberto's contract. Or if we don't, we don't get him. We it could possibly get Trent Alexander-Arnold out of Liverpool. Roberto doesn't want a release clause. And he wants to be paid three hundred thousand pounds a as a week. That means Bayern Munich might not have paid the clause. Let's head to the game against Getafe. Can Barcelona get on the board? Griezmann scored to make it a lady one against the one nil against Sevilla. Messi's got Messi's on the board for Barcelona. Riviera scored for Huesca. Hopefully they can get, get the get the points. Malcolm's come on for Suarez. Coutinho scored to make it two 0 and he's been booked. Malcolm makes it 3-0, Busquets is injured, and we got a 3-0 result in favour of Barcelona. At full time. Oh dear, Sergio Busquets is out with an ankle injury, and he's going to be out for seven weeks. That could mean Arthur Mello might be starting for Barcelona. So we're getting close to heading into the 2019-20 season. As we all remembered in in real life at this time, as we are one year, one, sadly we are one year away from something bad happening. And which is the COVID-19 virus.
Turns out in real life I actually did not get righted until the 2020 season. Barca win 3-0 against Levante with Suarez getting scoring a hat trick. As Barcelona. They could go through to the quarterfinals of the Copa del Rey. So far, Real not in a good pos So far, Real not in a good position. Third in La Liga. But they might end up having to play in the Europa League. Their luck's starting to run out. 2 0, 3 0. Arthur's been has picked up a second yellow plus a red. PK's injured. We just can't catch a break, Rot. We just can't catch a break this month. Injuries and suspensions have just done its toll. <laughs> Ouch. Well, that's Jared PK season done. Out with an ACL. Ouch. Well, that's it for... Well, that might be it for Barcelona's chances of winning the Champions League. Unless if... Unless if we do something in January. In the January window. We need to find another centre-back. Ernesto Valverde has been awarded the manager of the has been awarded manager of the month in January 2019. Can Barca win hold on to their 3 0 lead? Roger has scored to make it 3 1. We need to Luis Suarez has scored. Come on, boys. We need to park the bus. Thank you. 2 1. We are through to the. We are through to the quarterfinals of the Copa del Rey. Oriol Busquets, he might be online. Could be online to SPAL in Serie A in Italy. We got ourselves an away game against, got a home game against Leganes. There's going to be some good news coming to Barcelona really soon. We're going to be having Neymar back in the team soon. Aspas makes it 1-0. Coutinho got yellow carded. As we end the game with 4-0 win. Aspas with a double, Suarez with a brace, and Rakitic with a brace. <sighs> Oh well, at least we got Garana in the quarterfinal of the Copa del Rey. Come on, Barca, we can do it. Let's make it a treble, boys. We got Garana in the quarterfinals. Bang, 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 bang. 4-0 Barcelona. Coutinho, Messi, Suarez, Malcolm. All on the score sheet. And Klaus, and he actually wants to play. A fair bit, a little bit of footy. Wants to play a bit of football. We may not need him because Barcelona are in good form right now. We are, we're still two points in front of Real in the title race. Three points in front of... Five points in front of Betis and also five points in front of Valeni. We got an away game against Garano coming up. We need to win this to stay on top of the league. 
We need to be on top of the league, boys. Full time, it's 1-1. One, one. It's 1-1 one, one draw. And we're currently level in the title race. This is why to stack this is why we need to pick this is why we needed to stay good for this game. <sighs> of course fucking clear it has to ruin it. Oh well at least we're back at Garida for the quarterfinals of the Copa del Rey. Come on come on Barca. We want you won four nil at the new camp. And we just drew 1-1 one, one in the quarters and we go through to the semis of the Copa del Rey. 5-1 on aggregate. 5-1 on aggregate. Barcelona are through to the semi-final. Barcelona are fine. Let's take a look at the let's take a look at the other league standings in January. In January, it's well this might be the year this might be Zinedine Zidane left in the Premier League title of Man United. Because they are on sixty one points in a top spot. Spurs are second on fifty five, City third with fifty points, while Chelsea sit fourth with forty eight. Well Arsenal and Liverpool they could be occupying the Europa League spots. With Brighton, Newcastle and Cardiff in the relegation zone in England. Let's check France. Well, Jürgen's starting to drop some points at PSG. He needs to pick up points soon, otherwise they might lose the league title for the third season in a row. To Mar this time to Marseille, let's go to Germany. Well, this could be a four-way race for the title between Bayern Munich, RB Leipzig, Bayern Leverkusen, and Borussia Dortmund. Italy, meanwhile. Well, Juve are top of the league. Into second. Roma third. AC Milan fourth. As we might be seeing those four teams in the Champions League. We're going to be playing Real Betis in the Copa del Rey semi-final. And... Oh no, now Messi's out of the side. Oh no! This is not looking good right now for Barcelona. Who could be called up? How about we give Gabriel and Xavier a call up? From the Youth Academy. Gabriel Xavier might be time to give him some training. Is he could be could be like the what well, Ansu Fatty it could be a real life version of Ansu could be like Ansu Fatty in real life. <coughs> that young the young lad at Barcelona has, have signed. Simulate the drills for Xavier. Hmm. 
Anyways, let's head to the game against Valencia. Clears, and he might be he might be leaving Barcelona at the end of the season. Oh dear. How's Barca going to fare without Lionel Messi? We still managed to win 2-0 with Aspas getting on the score sheet twice. At least Iago, man. At least I could think Iago saved our ass, saved our butts. Well, Kike Setien, a.k.a. the future Barcelona manager. He's been called tactically weak by his... by the guy who actually got sacked for a bit, Barcelona. We might be seeing Neymar come back soon for Barcelona. Let's see how we go against Real Betis. Rakitic makes a, a, gets a goal in the opening minute. Did take long at all. And we still end the game 1-0. In the Copa del Rey semi-final. Barcelona are still top of the league on 49 points. Neymar is back. Back from injury. Might have to start Neymar on the bench. Because he's only just coming back from injury. Got 16 games to go. Sergio Busquets is also back from injury for Barcelona. Could it? This could be the last time we'll be seeing Andres Iniesta in a Barcelona shirt. Neymar is starting on the bench along with Sergio Busquets. Cap has been carded. Yeah, there's this been some cards and injuries going off for Bill Bilbao. Full time ends, it's 1 1. Neymar. We're super sub Neymar coming off the bench. Coming off the bench to make it 1-1. One, one. Sorry, Malcolm. Well, get used to the bench now. As we've got ourselves around a 16, a game against Borussia Dortmund. Well, we've got to get our passports ready and we're heading off to Germany. And Erling Haaland has been unnerved by the Barcelona manager in the press conference. Let's see how Barca fair against Borussia Dortmund. Suarez makes it 1-0. Royce makes it... 
Marco Ross makes it 1-1. One, one. Aspis makes it 2-1. Barcelona 2 1. Meanwhile, in the other game, Inter Milan win 1 0 against, win one -nil against Chelsea. Next up is Real Valladolid. Aspas on the board early for Barcelona. Suarez makes it two. Joe Quinn is injured for Real Valladolid. Suarez makes it get breaks it another bags it another brace. Suarez makes it four with a hat trick. Rakitic makes it five. Suarez missed the chance to make it six nil. Barcelona, they have been bossing it so far in 2019. Could they win the Champions League? As for the Champions League, PSV win 1 0 against Man City, while PSG and Tottenham tied 2 2. Man United stuck free past Porto, while by Munich win 1 0 against Atletico Madrid. We got our game against Sevilla postponed. Hopefully Messi could be back soon. Let's see how his injury status will go. Let's see how long he's out for. He'll be fit in seven weeks. He'll be 100% fit in seven weeks. He should be right to go for the for the knockout stages of the Champions League. Can Barca hold on? Can Barca win the Copa del Rey? Two nil, Barca are going through to the final of the Copa del Rey. The final. Now Barca are heading to the final of the. About to be heading to the final of the Copa del Rey. As long as it's not against Real Madrid. Otherwise, we might end up, might not with that being fallen there. They lead three one against Sociedad. This could be, this could be an El Clasico Copa del Rey final. <coughs> Suarez has netted its sixth day this season.
We've got the second El Clasico game of the season. Got six promoter from the Youth Academy. Let's check this guy. Barcelona got eighty thousand dot pounds. We're going through to the next stage of the Copa del Rey. <coughs> and now, we got the second El Clasico game of the season. Against Real Madrid. 1-1 one, one draw. But, Barca just about bounce back from losing 8-0. Well, it turns out Edison Cavani's out of he's out of PSG. And he's been sold to Real Madrid. As we've now got the second leg against Dortmund. Can Barca advance through to the quarterfinals? Or will Dortmund advance to the quarterfinals? Roberto got Sergio Roberto got a yellow card. Hubbles has been yellowed for Dortmund. Oh, it looks like Chelsea might be Chelsea might be getting their revenge against Enza. They lead 3-0, while well, Barcelona lead 1-0 against Dortmund. Can they park the bus? They do. Barca have parked the bus and are going to the quarterfinals. They are going through to the to the quarterfinals of the Champions League. We got the second game against Vaticano. We absolutely we fresh them four 0 Barcelona are in the game. They're in the zone right now. They have not lost the game all 2019. That is that is a result. Champions League. Spurs went on away goals against PSG in real life in 2019. They've won two legs by what two times by away goals. Manchester City win 4-1 against PSV. Chelsea win 3-1 against Inter Milan. While Barcelona go through 3-1 against Dortmund. Vidal's about to become a bat into the side. Barca are going to be getting an extra nine million pounds for their ch for the champion for their Champions League participation. Let's check out the Check out the rest of the round of 16. United with 1-6-3 six, six, on aggregate against Porto. Bayern Munich go through 3-2 on aggregate against Atletico Madrid. Ajax go through 5-1 on aggregate against Hoffenheim. While Valencia go through 5-1 on aggregate against CSKA Moscow. Let's check the Europa League round of 32. A 
Stacey Milan won free two on aggregate against Bordeaux. P-A-O-K. Milan, P-O-O-K. Shakhtar. Sevilla. Real Madrid. Monaco. Arsenal. Dynamo Kiev. Fiorentina. Leverkusen. Roma. Marseille. Besiktas. Juventus. Red and Leon all going through to the to the next round. In the next round, however, we'll let you know soon. Once I step past this date. Let's check the Europa League. Let's check we'll see what's happened in the Europa League. Leon won 3-2 on aggregate against against Ren. Fiorentina won 5-3 on aggregate against Dynamo Kiev. Arsenal won on away goals again, this time against Marseille. Juve win 3-2 on aggregate against Besiktas. AC Milan go through 4-2 against Roma. Bayer Leverkusen go through 5-1 against Monaco. Real Madrid have thumped PAOK 5-0 on aggregate. While Sevilla go through 4-3 against Shakhtar. As for the quarterfinals of the Europa League, you got Juventus versus Arsenal, Real Madrid versus Fiorentina, Leverkusen versus Leon, and AC Milan versus Sevilla. Anyway, let's get back to La Liga. So we are playing away against Real Betis. We win 2 0. Barcelona have got... Their momentum is looking very good right now. Who oh, knows? This could be the year Luis Suarez wins. This could be Luis Golden Boat. But he has to get past the scoring Kareem and Antoine Griezmann. As we got our next game against Sevilla. Come on, Barcelona, you can do it. Got f two more games to go to the international break. <clears throat> we check the Europa League draw. Let's check the Champions League draw. In the quarters, you got Ajax versus Bayern Munich, Chelsea versus Man United, <coughs> Barcelona have got Man City. Man, this is going to be tough. The rematch of the 2018 semi final. When Man City won on aggregate. While Valencia take on Spurs. Next up, we got Sevilla. Let's get past them. And we do with 3 1. Neymar is not showing any rust. We've got the press conference as we got back on Espanyol. Well, everything's looking good here at Barcelona. Everything's getting... Everything is rosy here at Barcelona. I think Messi might be fit... Messi might be fit to play soon. Which will be good news. And now... We got Espanyol to get past. 4-0. We do it quite easy. Suarez with another hat-trick. Well done, Luis Suarez. Four goals. Barcelona, I got the best defence in the league right now. I got conceded just 14 goals. I think Ernesto's, ta Ernesto's tactics is to basically park the bus. Real Madrid, well, it looks like Barcelona are ahead in the title race on goal difference right now against Real Madrid. With nine games left. In the Champions League. Let's check the other leagues. Let's check the Prem. Well, Man United, well, it looks like Liverpool will start to gain, gain some ground on Man United. With United still top on 72 points. Liverpool second on 68. Well, this is looking like a down year for Man City. 62 points.
Arsenal on 60, Chelsea 59, Spurs 58, Everton 54. Well, it could be proven this could be the end of Maurizio Pochettino at Tottenham Hotspur. Well, half the other half the time the other legs just tables aren't just aren't very consistent. PSG top France. Bayern still top Germany. Well, not well. See, see the other legs aren't very consistent. Let's just not worry about that. Let's just focus on Spade. CR7 with two goals to make it 4 0 Portugal. Well, good news for Barca with Lionel's. Lionel's looking set to be back. There'll be some good news coming up. As we are so going to be heading into May. <clears throat> Don't think we really need Antoine Griezmann at Barcelona. Because the Argo Aspas is good is already good. He's actually good. In Spain. Unlike in England. Germany wins her one against Portugal. Anyway, we got nine more games to go. As the ninth, as we're soon to be heading into the 1920 season, we got the court, we got nine games to go in La Liga. One one. Well, luckily Luis Suarez saved us, saved us from losing. Oh no, now Clement Langlet's out injured. No we can get met. Well, it looks like we're going to be starting Morello down back again. Super sub Lionel Messi makes it 1 0 Barcelona. What a substitution. What a substitution by Valverde. Messi has... <sighs> to avoid further pain, it's probably best to start Messi on the bench. Just for a bit... Might have to start him on the bench for the quarter final against City. And it's 2 0 Man City. Well it looks like our champion looks like Barcelona's champion Champions League dream might be over. Unless if they come back in the second leg. Unless if they come back in leg two. Seven more games to go. We got Horst Husker coming up. Oh, 
Well, looks like Aspis is back to starting off, back to warming the badge. Due to the MSN reunion. 3-2. With Neymar rescuing the win. Next up, we got the second leg into the, the quarter-final. Will Barca go to the semi-final, or will... Or will this be Mayor City's... Or will this be Mayor City's finest hour? Yep, we're out. We're out of it. We're out of Europe. Barcelona crash out in the quarter-finals. As this could be Man City's year to win the Champions League. As however this time pairs me on neither and top the group. Oh well there's always there's always next season Barcelona for the Champions League. Let's check out the rest of the quarterfinals. Spurs smash Valencia while Man United beat out Chelsea. Zidane gets Man United through to the semi-final. While Ajax will go through 2 one lose 2-1 to Bayern Munich. That means in the semis we got Bayern Munich versus Man City and Spurs versus Man United. In the quarter semis you got Real Madrid for Europa League. You got Real the Madrid versus AC Milan and Juventus versus Bayer Leverkusen. Who knows, this could be Real Madrid's year to win. Oh dear, what's happening with Ernesto? <sighs> Barcelona crash out of the Champions League. Well, his days might be numbered. 2-1 Barcelona against Real Sociedad. Oh dear. This is going to be looking like, this is going to be looking disappointing for Barcelona. Not even winning, not even winning, you know, not even winning La Liga might be. Not even winning La Liga or Copa del Rey might potentially save it from getting sacked. Alaves win 1-0. Oh dear. It's not looking good. Now Philip Coutinho's out concussed. We need to beat Levante. We got four, but we got three games to go, guys. Get your act together, Barcelona. Three nil. Thank you. We could still win. We could still win La Liga. Although we're out of the Champions League. Oh well, at least we could still win the Copa del Rey and the and La Liga. Gerard Pique is back from injury. And I reckon he'll start on the bench. <coughs> it's, got, it's best to take it slow on his progress, otherwise he might potentially get injured again. Well, Nelson Samato wants to play in this game against Celta de Vigo. Can Barcelona... Can they seal the... Can they seal the league? Or will Celta de Vigo put Real, get Real Madrid back in the title race? Final score is 2-1. Oh dear. Real back. Real just about back in the gut. Oh well, at least we're getting eliminated in the quarter. Sadly, the quarter got taken quickly in the court for Man City this time in the quarterfinals. In the Champions League. Well, it looks like Tottenham are going through to the final to face Man City. 
Is this time it's going to be Man City going to be the England representative for the final instead of Liverpool? Could Tottenham get some could Tottenham get some silverware, or will Man City make it back to back Champions Leagues? Anyway, in the oh my no. Oh. Oh dear. Well, it looks like Faith has lost a plot with half his other league tables. They've got Arsenal top of the league now under your Emery. No, 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 Thomas Tuchel. They've got PSG winning. PSG, I reckon that they've converted convert as league on champions. And it looks like Bayer Leverkusen might win Germ. In real life, Bayern Munich have won in Germany. And I reckon the old lady must have won in Italy. We got get Getafe. We got to get this, boys. Three one. We need Real. We need Real to drop points badly. And now Rakitic is out for four months. Well. Now Real Madrid's back top of the league. One more game to go. <sighs> Come on, Ernesto. You you need to you need to win this league title. One one. One one, Real got the three points. <sighs> Nothing right who's enough. And it looks like Jose Mourinho has done it. He has got Real Madrid back to being La Liga champions. Bye bye, Mr. Valverde. Your manager. <sighs> manager. He's becoming a manager managerial dunce. Oh dear, what's going on with Ernesto? He's becoming a... He is becoming a managerial dunce. Yikes. This is not good news for Barcelona. How did this happen? Worst comes to worst, you might potentially lose Copa del Rey. Worst comes to worst for Barcelona, you, know, you might potentially lose the Copa del Rey final to Real Madrid. Damn. I don't think Neymar's even helping at all. Or maybe it's the manager. Or maybe it's, or maybe Valverde's not, not tactic, he's, he's not very tactical as manager, and it's, Arrow went on pads, 3-4, this is a, this season, this season was a disaster, this has been Barcelona's worst season, this has been their worst, 28-8, 2019, this is not good, this is not good enough, not, this is not, that's not good enough for Barcelona. Oh, God. What's going on with this club? What are you... T what are you doing, Ernesto? Let's check to see what happened in the Champions League. Mad City are champions of of Europe. And Juventus the champions of Europa League, beating AC Milan in the final. In the words. In the words of Anne Robinson. Ernesto. You had you expected you were expected to win three trophies this season at Barcelona. You left 
empty, you left the team empty-handed. You are the weakest link. Goodbye!